Hello guys and dolls, my homie and fellow badass, Kelly Pavlik said that if there's anybody to beat Floyd Mayweather, it would be Amir Khan. Well, Amir Khan's BFF and next door neighbor, Ricky Hatton, who I'm sure you all know how much I love, uh, seems to really disagree. So Ricky is basically saying that not only would it be a mistake to fight uh, Floyd, it would be a grave mistake to fight Floyd Mayweather. You guys get the picture. You all know I love Amir Khan. I love him to death. He's one of my very favorite fighters. However, I can't stand Ricky Hatton. But I kind of agree with Ricky here. See, while Khan is damn near an all-around fighter, he lacks some really core elements. And those core elements that he lacks... Floyd Mayweather, he just, he, that is what he dominates in. The inside fighting, the going, and that is what he absolutely kills at. There's nobody in the boxing game that does it like Floyd does. He's not one of my favorite fighters, but I recognize skill. If you all remember last week, within 20 minutes of the con inquisition, if that's what you want to call it, there was word that his next opponent was going to be coming out and it was going to be a humdinger and a shocker and all this other stuff. And word was quickly leaking out that it was going to be um, Floyd Mayweather. And even Team Khan was kind of hinting that that's what it was going to be. Now this may be another instance where Team Khan kind of jumps the gun and really nothing's really going on and maybe they just crossed paths and Amir was like, yeah, I'd like to fight you. And Mayweather's like, yeah, let's fight. That may have happened or maybe they're in complete negotiations. Who knows at this point? But I have to agree with Ricky Hatton. This doesn't seem like a very good move on Khan's part if he's taken this seriously. I know he wants to retire early. I think he's wanting to retire by 28. He already has a few different businesses in, in uh, Bolton right now, which is a little suburb outside of Manchester in England. Uh, he's really wanting to focus on the business aspect. He's engaged to Farrell. He's got a lot going on in his life. So maybe this is the kind of fade to black that Amir Khan's been looking for. Clearly, he's not going to win against Floyd. Uh, especially if he looks to fight him within the next year. that's It's just not going to happen. Um, but if he's looking to retire, maybe it is the best decision for him. All right, Amir Khan, Floyd, Mayweather. Good idea, bad idea. On the part of Khan, clearly Mayweather's going to win. Uh, but is this a good decision for Khan business-wise, boxing-wise, life-wise? What do you guys think? Uh, let me know by commenting below. I don't see this going well as far as his boxing uh, is considered. But for the most part, he's not really respected here as a boxer anyhow. He's just really respected in England. So perhaps he's going to fight Floyd and then, you know, go back and handle all his business. Because he has, like, Kell Brook that he could, you know, go up against. He has Prescott that he can handle. Um, and he's still really respected over in England. But what do you guys think? Good idea, bad idea? Let me know your thoughts by commenting below. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Take care. God bless.